There they are. Two wonderful galaxies right on the screen here. We, my friends and I, we are here on the beach on the west coast of La Palma and the sky is the most clear sky I've ever seen in my life. Back at home there's a lot of light pollution and the sky here on an island that far away is really, really beautiful. Right now I'm capturing M82, Boats Galaxy and the Cigar Galaxy with my telescope. We have three hours left in the Im imaging plan, so it's gonna be a late night. It's currently midnight almost. So we're gonna be here for a long time. But most of this vacation there were clouds, clouds in the sky. And I didn't get any chance yet to get a good picture. So on this night, um, three, three days before we fly off again, so I hope that this picture turns out to be good at least, if not a very nice picture. So I hope for the best. So. This is my entire equipment for astrophotography. I got the telescope, the Skywatcher HEQ5 and I don't know, there it is. Uh, this is a Canon D5500, I think. Uh, it's from my friend Leon. And on the imaging laptop right here, you can see our pictures for now. There's Boats Galaxy and the Cigar Galaxy in the constellation Asa Major. I believe that's what it's called in English. And this 
Entire equipment is powered through one single power bank right here. So we're gonna make photos all night until it's complete, completely empty, so it's gonna be a very long night. Simultaneously, we have a smaller tripod and another DSLR. It's a Nikon 7000 and we are trying to make star trails, to make beautiful star trail images. And right now I've heard that there's been captured another picture, so let's look at that. So. The software I'm using to capture these images is APT, Astrophotography Tool. I think it's the main program that most people use to capture their images. And I'm um, also using an auto guider with a small guide scope. Okay, you can't see it in this darkness. With a small guide scope and a small guide camera in the back. And the guide program I use is PhD Guiding 2, PhD 2 Guiding. And <laughs> if you know what PhD graphs should look like, this is not it. I don't know what's wrong with the auto guiding today, but this graph should not look this edgy. <laughs> so I hope this will sort itself out in the night as the galaxies are rising high in the sky and I hope that we will get a good picture.